what is going on guys it's a battery receiver welcome back to another youtube video now guys today we've got this the datsun fairly dz from nissan and this is actually from kaido house and mini gt uh, we have had two other kaido houses in the collection i did videos on that recently i'll put the link to those videos in the description below but today we've got this a datsun fairly dz and we are going to do a quick unboxing so it was actually sealed and i actually removed the seal to have a look at the car before I start the video, because I want to know what I'm talking about before I show show the car, guys, show it to you guys, right? So here you go. Um, all right. Before I get to the car, let's just talk about what the box itself. So obviously it says Kaido House Mini GT right here, and if you look at the side, it says Kaido House right there as well. We've got some Chinese lettering going right here. This is Team something, I guess, powered produced by Kaido House Racing. Here says Mini GT, and here we've got a bunch of warnings and um we've got the official licensed products stamp and the sticker right there so this reflector sticker really nice really nicely done and obviously we're gonna now dive right straight into the vehicle obviously with kaido houses and with this packaging you always get this very iphone unboxing vibe going on which is really nice to see very well done they actually know how to protect the cars i mean these are cars with great value in my opinion and i think the way they have packaged the car is really amazing so yeah we're gonna dive right straight into the vehicle and right off the bat, by the looks of it, this car looks insanely amazing. And you know what? Let's as usual, let's just start from the right side of the vehicle. Over here we've got the KNW decal right there. Let me just try to focus the screen a little bit. Let's see if we can get it. Oh, there you go. I do not know guys why my screen is glitching out like that. I'm gonna I promise I'll fix that issue. And I, I do hope you guys forgive me about the little technical difficulty that we are facing. Anyways, we've got KNW decal right there. Advent on the tires, the wheels spin amazingly well. This is actually five spoke rims. Obviously, they are look at the offset on the tires, remains insanely amazing. These are like it's a white body kind of thing going on, a right? huge fender flares. We'll get to get, get back to that in a bit as well. We've got Kaido House right there. The number zero grady Kaido right there, coil red decal also. Doesn't forget that. And obviously the very little attention to detail in this case is the door handles, I think. Just a little stroke of silver right there. It just adds that much character to the vehicle. And obviously the blue paint itself, it's very shiny, glossy paint job, which I think just adds that much character to the vehicle. Obviously, we've got the iconic um side mirrors in the front instead of the instead of where it generally is, right? And these are actually rubber side mirrors, which I think they can be quite fragile if you keep on hitting them. So you gotta be careful with these. And then the front front wheel is actually smaller, slightly smaller, uh, about the same size. As the rear, as you guys can see, high spot wheels been amazing. Well, it says Advent right there. Even more to the front of the vehicle, obviously, we've got coil red decal right there. It says Kaido House Zero, Kaido House right here. The same Chinese decal as that of as that of the box earlier on, right? If you guys remember this, it's the exact same thing. I don't know what it means, I'm gonna figure it out later on. But it says Team that produced by Kaido House, which is exactly the same as the box. Um, we'll get back to the rear in a second. Obviously, you guys can see this and you guys know what this is. The hood actually pops open and I don't know if this is how it officially is supposed to be, but there's actually a gap un underneath for the hood to open. So I'm going to just try to ever so slightly open the hood. There you go. And from there, you guys, you guys can actually see the engine right there. It's this Kaido House. The amazing engine, the blue and silver paint job. I think really looks amazing. And you know, I just like this, right? Just check it out. It looks, it looks amazing. I mean, I think Kaido House and Mini GTs in general, they're knocking it out of the park with their Kaido Houses, the Datsun 510 Wagon, as well as the other one, I forgot the name. And of course, there's this as well. I'll show you the others that I have in my collection in a bit. Don't worry, stay tuned to see them if you've not watched the other videos. But you guys can check out the link in the description below. Once again, do check them out. And yeah, so it says Kaido House right there. Grady, Kaido, Coil Red, the Zero Decal right there as well. Advent. Advent decal on the tires, the wheels been amazingly well. Front and rear both very well done on that KNW decal right here as well. If you look at the rear of the vehicle, here's where it gets interesting because the dad's in here. There's just something about this that makes the car look so insane. And Girth Nation, welcome back to the channel. Cause check this out. This girl, she's girthy, guys. She is insanely girthy. And they are, obviously, we've got a huge exhaust pipe. It's very common with this with cars like this. The rear brake lights these are actually plastic brake lights with painted and the painted on top which is that much more awesome the little attention to detail just shows you why these are more valuable than a lot of hot wheels out there right now or other cars even we can see a yellow road cage inside the car 
on on the windscreen at the back we've got techno toy tuning options auto auto salon and we've got some garage and the chinese street writing as well um very nicely done even the details in the interior you guys can see the blue interior the blue seats you guys can see the dash right there it's a right hand drive vehicle and obviously the yellow roll cage as well so i think the, the, the insane attention to detail is amazing and then you guys can see this little gap here um through which the exhaust pipe actually goes out which is very nicely done and obviously with kaido houses you get this very purple iridescent base and obviously the opening which i assume is to pop out the hood because I tried with, I mean, obviously I don't have nails, right? So I tried to open, it's actually quite difficult for me to open. So I assumed they left the opening for me to actually prop the hood up a little to help me open the hood. But I don't know, I do not see any other reasons for them to have this opening because it's really not visually pleasing, I would say. Obviously, we've got Made in China, Kaido House, Mini GT right there. The 1971 Nissan Valley DZ used under license. So yeah, guys, let me know in the comments below how you guys like this car. If you guys liked it, do let me know. If you guys didn't don't like this car, let me know as well. And let me know what other type of content you want to see. But just like I guess we're gonna do a filling shot and I'll see you at the end. Uh, oops, sorry. Uh, before I go, like I promised, I, I, I wanted to show you both these cars. So here are these. So obviously we've got the two Datsuns right here as well, which just amazing. Just look at them. They look really, I think they look really amazing. Really well done with the pink as well as the purple right there so i had the purple first in my collection and then i had the pink as well and obviously the hoods over here they open differently and they open easily compared to the the one that we just unboxed today so let me know guys we've got three variations so far there are a couple more variations that came out i have not gotten them yet but so far now i've got these three variations let me know in the comments below guys which one you prefer and why but yeah like promise we're gonna do a few ring shots now i'll see you at the end Just like I guess we've come to another video. I hope you guys had an amazing time. I should have missed unboxing this card. This insanely amazing Kaido house is gonna go superbly well in my collection. Let me know in the comments below, guys, if you think I should collect more of this, or if not, let me know what else I should do a review on. But just like I guess this video is over. I'll see you in the next one. And I'm out. Bye.